Sixpence is one of the first to show, with Hal Kapoor right up there and Flown also, and Steve Don also in the front rank, and also Soft Day. And it's Soft Day, who's just about taken it up, but uh, not too willingly, under restraint as Steve Don goes to the front now. Steve Don from Soft Day, son of Sixpence over on the far side, and Flown, and behind them come Fortune and Fame. And then Hal Kapoo, and behind uh, Hal Kapoo is Aston again as they come down towards the first flight. Stevedon's the leader from Flown and Hal Kapoo, the second, I should say. Stevedon lands in the lead from Flown. Soft day over on the far side, then Hal Kapoo, Fortune and Fame on the near side. Then behind them come Talbot. And just in behind Talbot is Current Express with New York Rainbow. Song of Sixpence not far behind the lead, polishing one of the back markers, and the actual back marker is Miss Bobby Bennett now. As they run downhill, Steve Adon, the leader, from Flown, Soft Day on the inside of Hal Kapoo, then Fortune and Fame, then Song of Sixpence, and behind the Song of Sixpence is Talbot, coming to the third. New York Rainbow is next, with Current Express upsides him, and over on the far side, Baden Star as they jump the third and all jump it successfully. Steven on the leader from Flown. Halkapu, soft day on the inner. Fortune and fame going up to join them on the outer as they race towards the next. This is the fourth and Steven on and Declan Murphy is still leading them. From Flown, soft day, fame and fortune and Halkapu beginning to swing left-handed now. Still Steve Adon has made most of the running so far by two from Flown. Soft day on the inner, then comes Hal Kapoor, Fortune and Fame. Behind them, Talbot, Song of Sixpence. New York Rainbow's making ground. Current Express comes next as they come to the next flight. This is the fifth of the eight flights in all. Steve Adon landed in the lead from Flown. Hal Kapoor going very smoothly in third. Fortune and Fame four on the outside, Soft Day five. Then quite a gap to New York Rainbows being chased by Current Express and then making ground from the rear is Peter Scudamore on Barry Window as they run downhill with three to jump. Steve Adon is still the leader from Hal Kapoor, Soft Day and Fame and Fortune on the outside. Flown is also right there with them. Coming down to the next, Steve Adon, Flown, Hal Kapoor, Fortune and fame on the outside. It's flown the leader now from Hal Kapoor and fortune and fame. Then comes Steve Adon. Racing towards the second last fight, Flown is the leader from Hal Kapoor and Fortune and Fame. Then comes Current Express, New York Rainbows making good ground towards the outside, but Flown is the leader, Hal Kapoor's under pressure, so is Fortune and Fame. Then comes Current Express and New York Rainbow and Flown has gone clear as they race towards the last. Flown goes clear under Jamie Osman, this is the final flight and... Flown is well clear of Hal Kapoor, jumps it second. Fortune and Fame jumps it third. Then New York, Rainbow and Current Express. Flown flying as they race up towards the line from Hal Kapoor in second. New York, Rainbow's finishing fast into third as they race up towards the line. Flown wins the Trafalgar House Supreme Novices Hurdle. Second is Hal Kapoor. Fame and for Fortune and Fame runs on to be third. Just ahead of New York, Rainbow, Current Express next. And then Miss Bobby Bennett. And then Steve Adon and Soft Day. And behind them came Baden Star. Behind Baden Star was polishing. And then behind him came uh, Buckboard Bounce. And last, in fact, uh, was Talbot. And so the result, as we see Flown return to the winner's circle. First, number seven, Flown, owned by Mr. Edward P. Winfield. Trained by Nicky Henderson, who last won this in 1986 with River Seriog and ridden by Jamie Osborne. Second was number 10, Hal Kapu, owned by Mr. Athos Christodoulou, trained by Mark Tompkins and ridden by Adrian Maguire. And third was number eight, Fortune and Fame, owned by Dr. Michael Smurfit, trained by Dermot Weld and written by Brendan Sheridan with fourth, number 11, New York Rainbow, and flown getting a 20 to 1 quote from Corals for the 1993 champion hurdle. 
It had been a fairly sedate pace early on, but when flown went, by golly, he did. Not only is the, the first home-trained winner for the Brits versus this the Irish in this annual battle, he's also bred uh, at home. He's by Hopfoot, who stands at the Gaisley Stud at Newmarket. And once he went, he, well, he put the issue beyond doubt in a few strides. Hal Kapoor running well from Mark Tompkins' stable back. And Nicky Henderson's other horses, New York Rainbow, um, he ran well to be fourth. And Nicky's third horse, Current Express, who I think has got a real future, back in fifth. But here you can see Little Flown going for home for Jamie Osborne. Very stylish rider, Jamie, but taking no chances. Even though he's gone a long way, clearly knows horses can buckle up up this hill. He gave him a couple of reminders there to keep him going. Former Richard Hannon horse, as I say, the mount at home of Corky Brown, Henderson's uh, head man. He was one of the many who've started their careers. Fred Winter's stable and Corky, no mean judge. So first blood to Nicky Henderson in this battle. Hal Kapoor coming home in second place. And the colours of Christoph Asseldu. And there, just fortune and fame just holding on to third place from New York Rainbow. So fortune and fame slightly.